in this video, I want to build a prime numbers detector. A prime number is an integer, a natural number, that is not a product of two smaller natural numbers, as you can read here. Uh, we want to, to detect uh, a prime number between 0 and 15 because we want to use just four bits to represent our number. So uh, we are limited uh, between 0 and 15 using just four bits. And the prime number numbers between uh, 0 and 15 are just 2, 3, 5, 7, 11, and 13. So we want to light a LED in the output whenever one of these numbers is recognized by our circuit. So in this empty circuit I'm going to rename it and calling it prime detector and I put here four uh, input pin and I name it uh, I name it them B3 copy and paste and change the label B2 B1 and B0 these four input pin represent the uh, four bits of the input number so bit 0 is of course uh, the least significant bit and bit 3 is the most significant one uh, usually uh, bits are numbered starting from 0 the least significant up to the, the highest number which represents the most significant bit and I have just one output representing our LED and I'm going to project and analyze circuit and here we have our empty truth table and we can see that all uh, this, uh, this, this sequence of uh, uh, bits represent the sequence of numbers between 000 and 111 so we have a 16 combination of values which uh, represent all the integer number between 0, 1, 2, and so on till uh, 15. So this is uh, yet another way to see a truth table uh, because we can see a truth table, uh, the rows of a truth table, uh, we can see them as a, a binary number. A binary number. So uh, this is 0, this is 1, this is 2, this is 3. And by the way, if you don't remember the exact sequence of the number you can uh, use a little trick because the least significant number is going to 0 1 0 1 0 1 so it's all it always alternates between 0 and 1 and the next bit is 2 0 2 1 2 0 2 1 and so on and the next one is 4 0 4 1 4 0 4 1 and the last one is 8081 and so on. So this is a, a very easy way to, to write a truth table if you don't remember the exact sequence of all the numbers. So, so now, now we have to, to fill the truth table with the, the right values and uh, uh, this is 0 and our lead is going to be off because 0 is not a prime number this is one which is not a prime number either, so it's zero the lead. Two is a prime number, so we are going to, to light up the lead. Three is a prime number, four is not a prime number, five is prime, seven, six is not prime, seven, yes, eight, no, nine, no, ten, no, eleven, yes, twelve, no, thirteen, yes, 14 no and 15 no. So I click on build circuit, okay, yes, and here is our uh, prime number detectors. So I'm going to create a new circuit, I call it test, and I drag in this circuit our prime detector and I connect LED with the output here 
And now I want to have a 4-bit input representing our, uh, our number, but here is our problem because here we have four separate bits with 0, 1, 2, 3, and here our four bits are grouped together uh, in one uh, single input pin. And so we have to use this very useful component of logism, which is called splitter. And a splitter is just uh, um, a wiring, a wiring component which splits the bit of a group and separates them between the different bits. So here we have four bits all together, and here we have the single bit which compone this group. Uh, the problem here is that bit 0 should be connected with bit 0 here, bit 1 with b1 and so on. It's really important to, to, to uh, see which is the order of the bit and, don't, uh, and use it. So uh, we have a, a, an easier way to, to resolve this, solve this problem. It is to change the order of the output bit or a split and uh, go on in this go in this way bit zero bottom then two then one then bit uh, okay so you see now bit zero is at the the, the top uh, or the bottom it depends on uh, how you can uh, watch this splitter. And so zero is here, and now I connect it directly to B zero and one to one and two to and three to three. And I put also a X digit display because I want to see which number I'm going to test. So this is zero. I go to simulate mode. This is one, which is not a prime number, so the LED is off. This is 2, a 2 is a prime number, so the LED is on 3, and 3 is also a prime number, and 4 is not a prime number, 5, OK, 6, no, 7, OK, 8, no, uh, 9, no, 10, no, 11, as you, you, you notice that uh, 10 is A and 11 is B and so on. This is the hexadecimal notation. And then I go on to uh, 12, which is not prime, and 13, which is prime, and 14, and 15. And you see our prime number detectors works really uh, well because it detects uh, all the pre uh, when whenever a prime number is mm, right in the input the uh, circuit can detect it so that's all for today bye and see you in the next video